Today on the candy aisle, one size fits all appetites when you're talking about Ring Pop gummies. That is right, Ring Pop's return to the candy aisle with Ring Pop gummies. Now, this is a bit of a weird one for me, because uh, I did technically already review Ring Pop gummies, although I did not have this big bag. I was a little confused as to this. I, so I went to the store, I was looking for Ring Pop gummies gems, which is the new bazooka candy that they released alongside the, um, what's that one I just reviewed? Uh, the um, bo Baby Bottle Pop Gummy Blast, or whatever it was called, right? Uh, uh, so Ring Pops is a, sorry, Ring, back up. Ring Pops is from the Tops company, like Tops, like the, you know, the baseball cards, the hockey cards, whatever, those guys. Uh, and um, they uh, put Ring Pops under their Bazooka branding, I think pretty recently. I don't think that it was under Bazooka branding now. Now it actually has the Bazooka logoing on it. And under Bazooka, they've released some new things, including those, like I said, these b the Baby Bottle Pops Gummy Blast, as well as Ring Pop Gummies Gems, which are Ring Pop Gummies in the gem form, but they have a, uh, uh, like a sour juice in the middle of it, right? That's what I was looking for. And I got these ones by mistake, basically. And then I realized, oh wait, I did review these back in 2016, but I didn't have a bag of them. I only had uh, like solos of them. So I only checked out two of the flavors. I've checked out cherry and the blue raspberry before. But so we're just gonna try them again. We're gonna have another look at them and check out all the flavors because now they're under the bazooka branding. We've got, they come in these big bags. They come in cherry, strawberry, watermelon, and blue raspberry. So the strawberry and the watermelon are new to me for sure. I don't know why they say new though. I mean, I guess like these ones are the, are not the ones with the with the sour, you know, juice in the middle. Um, so these have been around since at least 2016, 2017, I think. Um, but you know, I mean, I guess they can call them new if they want. Maybe it's new because it's newly in this bag. <laughs> I don't know. Um, okay. Yes, it is. It is. It is something that you wear. Uh, it's gummies that you wear. I don't know if there's anything else on here of particular interest. I think we can just break into these and, and just see what see what we can see. I'll tell you. For the originals, I my sort of feeling. My original review. Ugh, I don't know why I had to rip that off. I probably should have just left it on. My original review. I basically said, look, they're fine, but. Why do we need ring popping gummies? It kind of does it kind of defeat the purpose? Like, is it kind of a little gross in a way? Uh, oh boy, they smell good. I'm a little concerned. Like, I guess you lots of gummies come in these kind of packaging, but like, does it feel weird that like, should these be in this kind of packaging? Where's my blue? There's a blue. There's at least one or two blues in there. Okay, there's lots of them there. Look at that. You could have a whole rings for your whole team when you win the championship, right? So, this is the ring pop gummy. Just like your traditional ring pop sort of shape, I guess, with a flat back. Um, but it's all gummy, of course. So it's supposed to be wearable, wearable food, you know? You slide the ring pop onto your finger. But unlike the regular ring pop, which is a lollipop, right? And then this ring part is plastic, so you can kind of just keep it for a while on your hand. This whole thing is gummy. So I guess you're being encouraged just to, you know, chomp away at it. Hmm. Now the gummy, it's a little chewy, but I don't mind it. Um, the, um, yeah, the flavor really jumps out. That's obviously strawberry. I like that a lot. What I don't like about this concept is that I'm walking around wearing a half-eating piece of gummy on my finger. Like, does anyone want to, like, look at that as you're walking around? I'm going to say... Probably no. And then, if I eat part of it, it's just gonna, it's just gonna fall off my finger and fall on the ground. <laughs> or do I have to like 
suck the whole thing off my finger or something. This just, I mean, okay, maybe they're designed for kids, but I just feel like this could lead to a lot of awkward or gross kind of looking situations here. Um, this one is the watermelon. Why do I have five on here? There's only four flavors, right? Yeah, it's only four flavors. I got two cherries up here because cherry is the best. Maybe. Let's try the watermelon. I'm glad it's watermelon and not green apple. Flavor's good. Like, as a gummy, totally fine. And I like the ring pop concept. I just don't know that a wearable gummy is a great idea. Bazooka has another one, another skew of this, that has come out or is just coming out. Ring, Ring Pop Gummies Chains. And, hmm. Could be more flavorful. The Chains variety replaces the gummy with like emojis and different sort of fun shapes. And then it strings them all onto, I think it's a necklace. Um, just like you would have, you know, a candy necklace. Maybe it's a bracelet. I don't know. I didn't look that closely at it. That seems like it might be a better idea. Assuming the, you know, the, the bracelet is not, it's just made out of string. Because um, then you could eat one and continue wearing it and it'd be fine. Although even still... Like a candy necklace seems like it makes more sense to me than gummies on a necklace. <laughs> what if it was hot and they started melting on you? Oh, terrible. That could totally happen with this too. Like, I love the fun factor here. Like, you could load these up and have like a, like a whole thing, right? Whoa, it's like a roller coaster. Like a little caterpillary roller coaster. Anyway, well, that's fun. You can put them on all your fingers, walk around all day. Do you want to? Well, the flavor is totally good. Flavor is fine. The concept is cute. I think that in practice, the practical execution of this is only so-so. As an idea, great on paper. Kids probably don't care about how it looks or maybe that it's a little unhygienic or gross. Um, but I do. <laughs> so I don't think these are for me. But you tell me in the comments below, do you like these? Um, and what, what do you like about them? Wouldn't you rather just have a regular ring pop? I don't know. That's what I think I would do. Or just get some other gummies. Anyway. That's my take on it. Walking to Candy Isle is going to rate the Ring Pop Gummies. I'm still going to stick with a 3 out of 5. Of all the flavors, I think the strawberry is the best, um, followed by blue raspberry, um, then cherry, then watermelon. Um, and I know cherry is the classic, but, you know, I'm still going to stick with strawberry. Anyway, that's my take. Thanks very much for watching, everyone. Let me know if you like Ring Pop gummies or just Ring Pops in general. And have you had a chance to see these other new Ring Pop SKUs that are apparently in uh, stores? I haven't seen them. But when I do, I will be sure to review them here on the Candy Isle. Thanks, everyone, for your time. I'll see you next time. So long.